All right, so Pisces, we're going to have a look at what's going to come up for you. Now, keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you. If you'd like a personal reading, I'll leave that description down below. Another thing you can do is um, we have a website, you know, where things are for sale. There's currently a sale going on, 50% off most items. So you should definitely check that out for it's over. And if you like donate to the channel, feel free to do so. Okay, Pisces, Pisces, I see a lot of money coming in for yourself here. All right, like a lot of... A lot of money opportunities and a lot of big business opportunities coming up ahead for yourself. Don't reject those opportunities. Like, I feel like you're not going to reject it. I honestly see you being more happier about it than anything because it's like, it's, you know, it's financial stability. So yeah, there's going to be like a lot of celebration over money coming in, Pisces, all right, over material wealth here as well, like properties and all that sort of stuff. Like there's, you know, it's that sense of celebration, like I achieved this, okay, which is good. Splitting the deck, we have the Three of Cups with the Four of Pentacles here, Pisces, all right. We have the Five of Wands here. We have the Page of Wands. We have the Hangman. We have Judgment. We have the Ace of Swords. Eight of Wands. Three of Wands. Nine of Wands, Queen of Swords, which is Air, Eight of Pentacles, Seven of Swords, Ace of Cups, King of Pentacles, which is Earth. I feel like you're embodying more of that King of Pentacles energy. Whether you have Earth placements or not, that's not the important part here. We have the the uh, the world. Nine of Pentacles with the Four of Swords here. Yes, Pisces. All right. Financial stability is coming up ahead for your life. All right. Um, hmm. I see someone returning into your life. Can be an air sign, Queen of Swords. All right. It doesn't feel like a love situation. I just see them returning to you. This is a person that you had drama and conflict with before in the past, and I see communication happening. All right, Pisces. What I also see is that you're you're finding out some truth about uh, a liar around you, and I see you kind of cutting off people around you here as well, Pisces. All right, you're taking a break from people, and that's when you're like. I also see a lot of, like, new beginnings for you. I see, like, a lot of new. I see you creating new. You know, it's like that new, new, new. All right, Ace of Cups, Page of Wands. And I, like I said, I see financial stability coming up ahead for you. Financial independence. Nine of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. All right. Four of Swords tells me that you can finally rest when you get to this point. So let's have a look at messages and advice for you. Number 18, clearing the access. You're entering a transitional phase and would benefit from clearing away excess clutter, whether it is in your physical body or your physical space. Look at this, clearing the excess, Pisces, all right? All right, whether that be, you know, your physical space, if there's like junk or clutter around, get rid of that. Um, or, you know, your thoughts that don't, you know, like kind of bad thoughts, you know, murky thoughts, or people that 
kind of bring you down in a way, clearing away that clutter, Pisces. We have number 46, facing your fears. Look for ways to strengthen your connection to the universe and others. Stay peaceful and calm in the knowing of who you are you're facing. Facing some fears here, apparently, Pisces. All right, we have number five, change direction with ease. This is time for change. Shape-shifting your soul's evolution. It is time to reconsider what you're wanting. You may be in for a surprise. All right, Pisces, you're like, this is a bit of a change from what you were uh, originally planning to do but it's so much better than what you originally planned like in terms of work and career and all that sort of stuff. what is this number 38 shedding the old there's a change coming your way cultivate a sense of adventure so you will be able to see these new prospects oh look at that yeah Pisces you're releasing the old onto the new remember when I was talking about that new 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 Number 35, help appears in various ways. There is much support for you. Sometimes you may get so adrift, you forget to look at the support systems that are with you continually. Pisces, all right, so yeah, look at this. You're having like help come in through this, like through this this uh, business opportunity, this job opportunity, whatever this is. But it, it comes in and it's kind of like a, a bit of a surprise and it's a bit of change in what you were originally planning on doing. We have lights. All right, lights. That can represent you. We have relaxation here. Yeah. Four of Swords, relaxation. You're gonna be able to relax here. We have feelings. What are you feeling? We have solitude, okay. You're wanting some solitude here. We have breaking free. Breaking free, yeah, the excess clutter, okay. And you're moving forward towards this newness, okay healing there's a lot of healing happening for you here as well apparently and re-energize you're gonna feel re-energized with this okay Number two, transparency, honest, authentic, genuine, present. All right, so what this is coming in, it's very transparent. All right, there's no deceit with this opportunity here. Okay, we have number 11 with sacrifice. There are those worth making, and then there are those that will destroy you. But be careful what you are. Uh, try not to get rid of too much of what is in your life. Okay, Pisces, when you're, when you're cutting off things from yourself. Number 38, a guide. A guide, a mentor, a trustworthy ally. Because it feels like you might be cutting off a guide as long as that, as, as, lo okay. as long as, as well as what you're, you get what I'm saying. I'm all tongue tied. <laughs> Alright, so try not to cut off like uh, people that you can really depend on. People who are really transparent. People who are really honest and, you know, genuine. Try not to cut that out of your life, you know. We had 35, the crane bag, sacred ocean medicine, clutter, declutter, choice, okay? This is all your choice, however, free will. Number 31, corals, wisdom, colony, delicacy, fragility, works that are created over great periods of time, so you're going to be creating something that's, like, really going to pay off big later. All right, may not be immediately, but it, it will. We have number seven, freedom, independence, self-determination. All right, yeah, Pisces, you're feeling more freer here, okay? five rare intersection of heaven and earth okay Pisces so you are that rare intersection of heaven and earth here you are the the in between heaven and earth you are on earth but you're connected to heaven we have number 11 once again the 11 number must be important for you here 11 11 or just 11 way of the divine feminine revealed okay Pisces look at that so going on to that more um, divine feminine path I guess and your male and female doesn't matter. We have number seven once again. So seven and eleven. Seven and eleven. <laughs> uh, those numbers are important for you. What must be shall be, Pisces. So what must be shall be. Things that are happening are meant to happen, okay? Number 32, nourishment of the soul. But you are going to be nourishing yourself here. You are going to be relaxing after all this. You know, you are going to be taking a little vacation. 
to yourself. Okay, so that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.